Ryan is just steady. Ryan is steady. He, he's committed to all of the the little things that make a team better, that make a person better, and, and uh, I think he pushes, because of his hard work, he pushes other guys to, to the limits beyond where they think they can get. It's been pretty easy this far, uh, thus far, sorry. Uh, we have uh, seven other, six other seniors, seven including myself, and it's been a pre pretty easy transition. They help me out. Uh, Kiwi takes care of the locker room. Uh, the freshmen take care of the count on the bus, so I just uh, meet with coach once a week and uh, try, to, try to get the guys riled up for the weekend. It's been pretty easy. It was a pretty unanimous decision among the guys and the coaches to name you captain. What does that mean to you? Uh, it means a lot. Uh, I just try to work hard and do the little things, and I guess it paid off. And I'm happy that they voted for me, but at the same time, it could have been any other of the six other seniors. So, When you were under, an underclassman, did you look up to any of the guys, admire anybody that you try to emulate now? Yeah, uh, Scott Mosier was captain my uh, freshman and sophomore year, and I try to be kind of like him, a quiet leader. He worked really hard, and he's a pretty good student as well, but I really looked up to him, and I lived with him for a couple of years, so I try to have him take me under his wing. You guys had the 11th best penalty kill in the nation last year, and you're a big part of that unit this year. How does killing off a big penalty help shift the momentum of a game? Yeah, uh, we saw last weekend against Holy Cross. We killed a five-minuter, and we also killed uh, a huge penalty at the end of the Mercyhurst game that we ended up winning. So I think it's uh, the little things that the guys that aren't on the power play that are on the penalty kill can do to get the rest of the team riled up. And we're just happy to work hard and block some shots. Well, Ryan, Ryan's got real nice stick skills and, and excellent speed. Those would be the two biggest strengths that Ryan has. So um, the... The penalty kill is a situation where when he is using his speed and he's tenacious on the puck, he's, he's definitely a guy that uh, can disrupt the other team's power play. So you had two big wins on the road last weekend. How does that help the team's confidence heading into this four-game home stretch? Well, confidence in winning, knowing how to win, and, and being able to recall those memories from what it took to win are, are always important. And you know, we're six and one in our last seven. We're we're undefeated at home thus far, and it hasn't been easy. But uh, Sacred Heart's coming in off two really tough losses against a good Robert Morris team. So we know that first and foremost, we have to bring effort, and that's what we were able to bring last weekend to get two wins. So we just want to repeat the high effort. We just have to work hard. We saw last weekend that we worked super hard, and we. We stuck to the game plan, and we actually weren't playing that well, but we were working hard, and eventually it paid off, and we got some power play, we got some big goals, but uh, we just have to work hard. We know any team in the league can beat us if we're not playing well, and if we're working hard, I think we can get uh, four points.